All right, hi, so my name is Philip, and we're hanging out here today. I'm very happy to be doing some playing. And we're gonna go over this song that's on my new album. The album's called Inner Evolution, and this song is called Changes. I'm gonna go over the chord progression. It's very straightforward, um, and a definite nod, and uh, a definite nod, and it's paid out of gratitude to some of my heroes, this chord progression. Um, it goes something like this. I'm just gonna turn on the fuzz face. So, it just goes like this. <laughs> So that's kind of the basic straight ahead way that those chords roll in that song. There's a couple of uh, modulations and things that happen, but that's, the, that's your basic straight ahead chord progression. Um, and there's a lead line that goes over that. I'm going to play it right now. Again, very simple, very straightforward. Uh, the idea of that was just to get something that you could hum and sing along. That ooh, ooh, just something straight, straight down the, straight down the middle of the road. Uh, there's another section that happens in this song that I play that has a Leslie on it, very straight ahead type thing. It's kind of based on an F pattern, I guess, and it goes like this. It goes. <laughs> So imagine that with a little bit of Leslie or, you know, some kind of tremolo pedal on it, some delay, and you feel a little tripped out. So that's kind of the uh, chord progression of the song changes. When it goes to the solo, it actually modulates to a different key, which I'll play right now. So coming out of it anyway, it starts on the D, moves to A. So we'll go like this. It'd be like... <laughs> And then that goes on live for maybe half an hour. But uh, so that should give you a pretty good idea of what that song is all about. And it's called Changes. So this is another song that I wrote. It's called Daydream Tonight uh, with my friend Dave Cobb. And this is a ballad. It's very straightforward. And there's comedians in the room. I love this. It's very funny. Um, very straightforward song. Um, again, based around the piano. Um, so check this out. Just very, very simple. Um, starts in C. And so. Anyway, something like that. Usually a little bit more in tune. <laughs> and then there's a middle section which gets very psychedelic, uh, for me anyway. And I'll play what, uh, I'll, I'll show you what it is. So coming out of it, we go. <laughs>
that's the middle section of that song. Um, Daydream Tonight, there it is. The end of it, sometimes I'll stretch out for a real long time and um, take an approach, and the live version, take an approach that would be definitely influenced by Eric Clapton, the way that he likes to, or he just does it naturally. He plays with a very uh, vocal approach, and maybe I'll show you a little bit of what, you know, my attempt at that thing is with my own voice, but uh, just kind of trying to make it sing a bit. So it'd be like a, you know. <laughs> Something like that, you know, just kind of, just kind of playing around. Yeah, okay, yeah. There's a song called "Little Miss America," and it's kind of just based on a funky riff. And I'll play it for you and just jam out for a little while. It's a very straightforward song. Um, so maybe I'll just have fun with it today. See what happens. All right. So, it sounds a bit like this. <laughs> You know, anyway, I get kind of lost in that, so it's fun. But that's kind of the, basically the song. It's just centered around a riff. And when you get, there's a chorus part, which goes up to the five. So it'd be like. So, you know, I'll give you an idea. It's like that. Um, again, these are just super basic, just touching on these things.